The Department of Agriculture, in collaboration with the Food and Agriculture Organization and the St. Kitts and Nevis Coast Guard through the Climate Change Adaptation in the Eastern Caribbean Fisheries Sector Project, held a VHF radio training program on May 12th at the Department of Marine Resources. The aim of this training is to ensure the safety and security of local fishermen in their exploits to the sea for the purpose of fishing. Director of the Department of Marine Resources, Dr. Mark Williams, said, quote, Over the years, we've seen a lot of fluctuations in fish landings here in St. Kitts and Nevis. We see that fishers are putting out more and more gear in the marine space, but the fish landings have not been what they are supposed to be. As we see persons saying that we have 60 fish traps, but we are catching 20 pounds of fish, end quote. He said that because of this, persons are venturing further out to sea in the hopes of accruing more fish, and as a result, taking on a considerable more risk. Other risks highlighted by Dr. Williams include the risk that they may not come back because of adverse weather conditions, or they may have issues with the engine on the boat. He added that fishing itself is ranked as the number two most dangerous profession in the world. As a result of this, the Department of Marine Resources has a part to play in terms of ensuring the safety of fishers remains paramount. He said that they want fishers not to worry about their safety at sea as much as this is the reason why they provided this workshop where persons can be trained in VHF radio as a starter. I'm Andre Huey for SKN Newsline.